So this is the Vernier system that we will be using. So Eilish is gonna plug in first the redox probe, which is similar to the pH probe that you will be using. Goes in channel one. And then she's gonna be plugging in the drop counter, um, which goes into digital one. Okay, so now both of the things are on. You can see that channel one is the redox probe and then the drop counter is digital one. So now Eilish is gonna just run a few drops through the burette. There are two valves, one controls flow rate and one controls drip rate. And you're gonna just test and make sure that that red dot comes on in the drop counter. So the red dot is coming on. So we know that it works and we can shut it off. So Eilish is now going to take the redox probe out of its buffer solution and place the waste beaker underneath it and clean it off by using DI water. So we wanna clean that glass bulb on there just to make sure that the buffer solution doesn't interfere with our titration. So now it's good to be put in the sample. So the sample will go underneath. Um, and then you wanna make sure that the probe doesn't touch the bottom of the glass. So everything looks good there, so now Eilish is gonna press play on the vernier. And then we can start to run a new titration. So she's gonna turn the burette valve and then we're gonna make sure that it lights up. Good, so the light is lighting up and then she's gonna hand swirl it to try and mix in the titrant into the solution. So this is what the graph looked like in the end. Um, so it reached the equivalence point. So now what we're gonna do is we wanna save it. So then we're gonna click File, Save, and then um, whatever title you want, and just click the box, and then you can type in whatever you want, and then click Done, and then click Save, and that's it. So now that the titration is done, Eilish is gonna take the probe out again, clean it with the DI water, and then we're gonna put it back into the buffer solution um, for storage purposes and then you're gonna discard of your sample as the lab states and clean up anything else that you need to.